Hey everyone, I uh, went to my LCS recently, got a couple things, uh, so I'm going to share them right now. First up, I got a probably a long overdue Ichiro card. Uh, this is a 2001, or a maybe late 2001, I guess, uh, because it has his basically full rookie year stats, but this is a Stadium Club Ichiro. This is a really nice, clean card, as Stadium Club tends to be. Um, Stadium Club is, the, the, the newest one is, it's still not out yet, is it? Hashtag, thanks, Tops. So I also got a Upper Deck Trilogy, Generations Future Materials of Yadier Molina. of the hated St. Louis Cardinals. Little, little piece, jersey piece there, but it is a uh, game used. That's the main thing I want to see. None of this uh, player used baloney or the, like during an auto signing Panini or Tops, like probably hands them a jersey and they put it on top of their head and then go, here you go. I used it. Whoops. Uh, real, real excited to get this one. This is numbered to 100 from 2005, an absolute memorabilia. Uh, game used Roger Maris uh, uniform piece. Um, it quite coyly says that it is an authentic game-worn item. <laughs> which means that it is probably pants instead of a jersey. Um, I know some of the pants cards, like, just straight up say pants. Um, but this one, it, it does say game used item. Um, probably pants is just a little less, you know, glamorous than an actual, like, the, the jersey. So they, they kind of avoided saying pants, but man, I don't care. Roger Maris relic. So this is clearly the away jersey. Um, gray, I love that old wool, uh, the old timer jersey pieces. Um, kind of a questionable design. I'm not, I'm not sure why they made Maris so tiny on it. <laughs> It's it's definitely a an awkward design on the card, but oh well. Um, okay, so oh, I didn't get this at my LCS. This is a uh, actually the other day I went to an exhibition game uh, at the Tokyo Dome. Samurai Japan, the Japanese national team, played an exhibition against the Fighters, uh, Otani's former team. So uh, I got, there was this little, like, uh, coin machine where you turn the thing and then, like, a little, uh, these are common in Japan. They're, here they're called, like, uh, gacha gacha machines. Uh, and you get, like, a little capsule toy or something out of them. They had them in front of the stadium, and you could get these uh, little, um, these are kind of neat, a little, like, acrylic stand. Uh, kind of a figure of one of the players. Um, the cool thing about this, too, is that it was kind of like cards. You didn't know who you were going to get. So the machine had, like, a poster, and it said, you know, you can get these players. Uh, so I decided to give it a try. I got uh, Shota Imanaga. Uh, he's a pitcher. So, of course, I wanted to get, like, Roki Sasaki or Murakami. You could get them, but alas... Uh, I got Imanaga, a uh, pitcher. Pretty cool. Um, I, I'm actually thinking of doing a, a video about that exhibition game, so stay tuned for that. Um, okay, so finally at my LCS, I uh, so I got these cards there, uh, the relic cards and the Ichiro, and then the guy there was just like, here, you can have these these packs. Um, he's, he was basically just like, you're in here all the time, so <laughs> here you go. And what they were was, uh, they were packs, promotional packs, 
for the Tops of the Class promotion, which I guess was uh, something where it, you students, kids, if they if they took their report card uh, to participating stores. Uh, I don't know which stores in particular, if this was card shops or like if Walmart and stuff got in on this, but if they took their report card to certain stores that participated, they'd get a free pack of cards. Uh, so pretty neat. So they gave me like five or six packs of these things. Um, I don't know. Maybe they said it was because I'm in there all the time. Maybe they can just tell that I'm just like a... I'm just like such a man child that they were just like, all right, just give these like kid get good gr cards for good grades cards to this guy. <laughs> um, so yeah, I'm going to show some of them. Uh, these are actually from 2020. So they had the 2020 packs laying around. First of all, every pack of five cards came with a Mike Trout sticker. Uh, so this is a sticker. Um, to be honest, like, I don't know why it's only Mike Trout, but every pack, I got five packs, and every pack came with a Mike Trout sticker. Um, you think they could have, like, chained, made it a few more players than just Trout. Uh, but yeah, Mike Trout sticker in every pack. So that's the sticker. And then here, I, I did pull the, uh, actual Mike Trout card. Um, I don't, this is number one, I don't know how many cards are actually in the set. You can see it's got that little mortar board, uh, tops of the class, uh, logo on it, so. I remember when I was a kid, uh, there used to be this thing, uh, it was like Pizza Hut. If, it was sim if you read books, uh, Pizza Hut, you could get, like, free Pizza Hut or something. So it was another one of those, like, get good grades to get stuff. I think Chuck E. Cheese did that, too. It's like, if you, if you bring in your, like, report card to Chuck E. Cheese, they would give you, like, free tickets or something so you could get the, like, crappy prizes. Um, here's a Francisco Lindor. That's just an awesome card. Look at that picture. Um, and then I got, uh, let's see here, Nolan Arenado. And th these are not all the cards. I kind of just picked some highlights up. Aaron Judge. My man, Lorenzo Cain. Gone but not forgotten. Well, I mean, not, he's not dead. I guess that's, <laughs> that's what you say when people die. But uh, he's retired, of course. Um, Justin Verlander. Once again, a World Series champion. Once again, a Cy Young winner. Well, that second one is pretty much all but assured, although not official. And I got the Miggy. So then, uh, finally, I actually, man, I was thrilled. I didn't know you could get parallel, or I don't know if these are paired. This uh, parallels or not, but. Um, I got a numbered foil card in one of my packs. Super awesome. Check this out. Sandy Koufax. And this is numbered to 299. So I got a nice uh, Sandy uh, foil pair, rainbow foil parallel in one of the packs. So that was definitely unexpected. Um, they did have some old timers in the set. I, I think I got a Don Mattingly, uh, maybe a Ricky Henderson, not the foil, but this was uh, my only, uh, yeah. So that's all. Uh, as always, guys, thanks for watching. Peace.